Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thank you for being here. Thank you for your likes and your comments and all of your positive energy. I really appreciate it. Let's tap in and see what Spirit has for us this afternoon. The Collective. Mm, Spirit, what is it you would like the Collective to know? Collective Energy, please, Spirit. What is it you would like the Collective to know? Collective Energy. Collective Energy, Spirit. What would you like the Collective to know? All right. Nine of Swords in the upright. Somebody's having nightmares. Maybe they're in some form of trauma or some form of despair. The energy is real thick. And reminder to you, empaths, not everything you feel belongs to you, okay? Especially right now. There could be people trying to put this kind of energy on you. You may be feeling a little um, edgy with your patience and your emotional body right now because you're either picking up on people who are experiencing this or you are picking up on somebody trying to offload this onto you. Anxiety, worry, fear, a sense of hopelessness. And it could be that somebody just wants you to feel like them or they want to offload it because damn. So in the challenge position. Wow. Okay. In the challenge position. Oh. There's nine of wands reversed. So um, somebody is struggling, they feel overwhelmed, they're paranoid and exhausted regarding a Six of Cups. Regarding a return to innocence, regarding um, innocent relationships, regarding a nostalgia or a return to the past. Somebody's having feeling overwhelmed and on edge about a return to the past. In the subconscious, oh, whoopsie, got another one here. Got another one here, we got the hermit. A light is being shined on stuff. So there's a light being shined on stuff and somebody's in a nine of wands reverse. They're very, they're very defensive and paranoid and on edge because they don't want a return to, um, they don't want a return to nostalgia, but it's happy memories. It's not in the reverse. It's happy memories. So they're, they're exhausted and they're paranoid and overwhelmed because these happy nostalgic memories of innocence and stuff are coming back. wild a light is being shined on <clears throat> a light is being shined or maybe a light is being shined oh a light is being shined on the history a light is being shined on nostalgic moments these nostalgic moments the history is being looked at so somebody's being challenged because whatever they did in the past is being looked at and they're they're being defensive and they're paranoid and feeling overwhelmed because of it so yeah the hermits here shining a light on their history and they're in a they're in a nine of swords energy in the subconscious there's a victory here so they're thinking about a victory somebody a pub somebody's public recognition maybe that's what they're thinking about that this is public recognition this is public somebody's going to come into an awards they made an achievement 
in the recent past. Yeah, five of swords, conflict. So there's been a victory over this conflict and somebody's in despair and trauma about it because their history, their entire history is being looked at with a light going through with a fine tooth comb. They're being all defensive and paranoid. Woo! Intention and expectation. Intention and expectation was to move on to transition, to move on to calmer waters, um, and continue controlling through manipulation. They wanted to misuse their power. That was their intention with this conflict is to, is to move forward with calmer waters and um, control and dominate, you know, that kind of stuff, which is what they wanted, a misuse of power. Releasing baggage, whatever they thought their baggage was. So in the near future, future we've got king of wands and the lovers a king of wands who's overcome challenges and he's coming into a union the lens is being looked through We have an emperor here, a leader, an authority figure who is disappointed and walking away or this emperor is causing somebody disappointment and a, and a need to walk away. We'll clarify all of that. In the environment, we've got the star in the upright. Spiritual fortune, hope, renewal, healing, rejuvenation. And then we've got this queen of pentacles and the hopes and fears. So there's a maternal um, figure who may be looking after this star. And in the outcome... We've got the Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. So there's limited success. Limited success for somebody, disappointments. They worked, they did a whole bunch of work without results, could be this conflict. They were expecting domination. They were expecting um, to be able to control and manipulate people callously while they themselves are rested in calmer waters. That's super wild. Or maybe somebody else is moving on to calmer waters and they're moving away from this tyrant or whatever. That's on the bottom of this deck, we have the Knight of Wands. So somebody's charming and unpredictable. Coming in what? They wanna bring conflict, rivalry and conflict. For the, for the completion of this cycle, there, it's, I guess it's just to them, it's never over. Yeah, the cycle of this empress. They want to bring conflict to the cycle of this empress, this star. Freaking wild. And they want to do it through a love, through a sexy love re relationship. So they want to come and plug in. King of Wands, I mean, it could be they just want to plug in so that they can bring fighting to the cycle of this Empress. That's exactly what this says. Knight of Wands wants to bring love and conflict to the cycle of this Empress.
collective energy, please. Spirit. Collective energy. What is it that the collective needs to know at this time? Please and thank you. Collective energy, spirit. Space. They're in solitude. <clears throat> Wherever they're at, they're in a nine of swords. They're given, they're getting uh, time to think about it or whatever. They're having ample opportunity to think. They're in fear and anxiety. They're depressed because the hermit is here uh, shining a light on the nostalgia, on the history, on these things that this person did. Oh, my boy. New chapter. And it's time to move on. There's been a victory here. Somebody's dishonest. This person, this Nine of Swords, who's ever in the Nine of Swords, whoever is this hermit shining a light on, they were dishonest and the history shows it. They were winning at all costs. They were fighting. They were being bullies. They were sneaky and abusive. Working in the shadows. The, the expectation was to um, leave conflict behind and to be callous and manipulative and um, dominate others. That was their intention. They feel broken about this. King of Wands is here. He overcame challenges. There is a lovers here, a strength of two together. Something about forgiveness. Somebody wants forgiveness. The Emperor is here, and there's an Eight of Cups, a disappointment and a walking away, a leaving behind. daydreaming it says i am always longing for you but it came out in the reverse somebody um isn't thinking about them they don't care and they're they're like they're not daydreaming about them so they have they're disappointed they have to walk away it's like i don't it's like whoever they were whoever they were fantasizing about doesn't want anything to do with them so they have to walk away this star is in the environment and we've got sabotage in the reverse. So somebody isn't able to sabotage this star. This star did not sabotage self. You've got the Queen of Pentacles here in the hopes and fears section. A supportive um, mother figure <clears throat> regarding a reunion. And then you've got whoever this is, this disappointed. They're disappointed. This, this person doesn't want them. It could be, um, and then, and they're, they're, they made mistakes and they're confused because this queen of pentacles is here. She's a mother figure. She's um, reliable, providing financially, practical support. She's working on behalf of this reunion. There's a reunion for this star who wasn't able to be sabotaged. So somebody couldn't sabotage this star. And they are in the outgoing energy in a seven of pentacles reversed. They are, um, they had limited success. Um, they worked without reward and results and they're disappointed. And they're still hopeful for hooking up with you. It's like they're just 
They're like a stalker, man. Like a freaking stalker. They just won't stop. They won't stop thinking about you. It's like, it's like, give it up already, man. Reminiscing about your soul contract. But what? What about it? You had to gain a victory over it because they were they were sticking swords in you and stuff. What about it? What what what? Missing our inside jokes with who? I mean, who were they having inside jokes with while they were putting swords in you? Because yeah. It wasn't you. They weren't Unless they were like telling you how great it was, uh, uh, joking with you, telling you how much fun they were having, putting swords in you or whatever. I don't know, man. That's just wild. Warped is what it is. It's like it's like warped. There's something wrong with the mental faculty. It's like they. It's like the more you suffered, the happier they were, and they were great with those inside jokes or whatever. I don't know, man. So they're in a nine of swords. They're in a space all by themselves, uh, given time to think about what has happened. They're in trauma and despair. I don't know what they're, oh, they're envious. They're hopelessly envious. About your new chapter. And about you. This hermit is here shining a light on their history. And they're overwhelmed. Trying to defend themselves. They're really on edge. Because all, all their skeletons are coming out of the closet. Of what they did. Growth. In reverse. They didn't grow. They were just envious and and uh, abusive. That's what they spent their life force on, just being envious and abusive. They didn't grow. They were dishonest. And there's a victory over this. There's some recognition. There's some public recognition over this. Like this is public. They were bringing, yeah, they were bringing abuse, wanting to win at all costs, wanting to steal, wanting to steal. Everything happens in divine order, a victory. So, they wanted your new chapter. They were fighting abusive relationships. They were fighting you. Now they're worried. They were working in this shadow side. And they're worried. They were fighting against you. And their intention and expectation was to transition and to control and manipulate and misuse their power. That was their expectation. To be callous. And they feel shattered about this situation now. They're in grief about this situation now. Pride. They're all up in their pride. It was all about pride. I'm the big God in the whole world. They're seeking forgiveness. This King of Wands overcame challenges. There is a love relationship here. Oh. So this King of Wands is disciplined. Overcame challenges. Natural leader. A visionary. There's lovers here. Somebody's asking for forgiveness. They lost their freedom.
they they're not thankful Yeah, and this um, King of Wands is disciplined with no fear. And there's a love relationship here. <clears throat> you got the Emperor here. He's not in reverse. He is in the upright. He's an authority father figure. So you've got the father figure here in the lens that's being looked through. And you've got the maternal figure here. They're surrounding this star. Who somebody isn't able to sabotage this star. They are, they're, they're hooking her up with somebody. They got this reunion going on here. They're looking out for her. Isn't that wonderful? And um, so they're, they're guiding this situation. And somebody's made mistakes and they're confused about this. Wow. Because this star doesn't want anything to do with them. She's like, get out, bud, bud. Move on down the road. And they're all disappointed. They got to walk away. And it could be very well be that this is this emperor here. He's like, no, the emperor could very well be rejecting this person. The emperor could be telling this person, this father figure could be telling this person to get. Because he knows that they want to try to sabotage the star. So he's like, hey buddy, you better walk on by. Walk on by. Oh, and it's escapism. It's escapism. Yeah, he's feeling like he has to escape. He's not allowed to bring adversity to this star. He cannot come in and sabotage this star. This emperor is forbidding it. It's a spiritual fortune here. The emperor is, is protecting this star and this spiritual fortune. Yeah. Look at this. You got friendship and trust in the reverse. So there are people that are not friends, that, that aren't trustworthy, trying to get in here. And you got sabotage in the reverse, so they're not able to sabotage. You got this Queen of Pentacles here. There is a reunion. She knows who this star is. They're being very studious. They're, very, they're paying very close attention. And this star... Could be sitting here, you know, getting all mad because she knows people are out there trying to sabotage her. And she knows that they're not friends and she knows that she can't trust them. And if she hears anybody pinging her in her mind, she might just tell them off because she, tell them what she thinks of them because she's aware that they don't care and that they're dishonest and that they and what they've been doing. Look, they failed. They made mistakes. They're confused. They failed. This Queen of Pentacles is wrapping up a reunion, man. These uh, these non-friends who can't be trusted aren't able to sabotage this star. They failed. They fail. And then you got this Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. So somebody's um, disappointed because they, they worked doing this kind of stuff against this star thinking they were going to get some kind of reward by, by hiding in the shadows. And they're disappointed because they worked without results. And now they're like, oh, but I still have hope. I haven't given up on us yet. Can we be friends now? Oh, they're under judgment. Yeah, they're under judgment. They're under judgment because you this star persevered. Yeah, and they're they're in denial. They're like they're like, wait a minute, I didn't do that. It's like, yeah, you came against somebody who possessed gifts of the soul that benefit themselves and others, and who knows that there's no greater goal than to love, man. And you're guilty of bringing war to somebody who is just here being courageous and abundant and sharing and caring. That's wild, man. And they're gonna have to accept. Uh, the things that they cannot change because this is over. 
There's a big old death to this. Endings. Endings and judgment. I don't know. It's like there's... There... The field of consciousness has been tampered with in a bad way. It's been twisted and manipulated. And unfortunately, it affects lives, you know? I mean, when people do that, it affects, like, entire v villages, cities, towns, groups of people. Marriage. They're envious of this marriage. They're in a place by themselves, in fear. They can't sleep. They're, they're having nightmares. They've been given time to think. Whoops. And they're envious over this marriage. There's a new chapter here. This, I guess this marriage signifies a new chapter. This person didn't grow. And this hermit is here shining a light on everything they did in the history. And they're, they're trying to defend themselves, but they're weary. And on edge. They're exhausted. Community. <clears throat> The community may have turned on them or maybe it's this this whole community of people that didn't grow it could be that this there was this whole community of people that didn't grow and that is being looked at very carefully now um, with this hermit shining a light on their history and what it was that they spent their time on they're dishonest Everything happens in divine order. There's a victory here. Immature woman or a younger woman was dishonest. Conflict from the shadow side has them worried. They were abusing people from the shadows. They didn't get the great fortune. They feel broken about this. They feel broken about this because you are moving on to calmer waters. They're, they're stuck in their pride. They wanted to dominate you and everybody else. They misused their power. They're getting a message. This relationship is ending. This relationship is ending. They want forgiveness. They have lost their freedom. They're not grateful for anything. This king of wands is a visionary. He's overcome his challenges. He's very disciplined. He has no fear. And we've got the lovers here. The marriage is here. They're envious about this marriage. And you got the lovers here. So, um, yeah. <clears throat> And you've got, yeah, again, look at this. You've got courtship and you got this thief. This thief wants to come in for a courtship. So this king of wands has no fear. He's very disciplined. He's coming into a relationship. And then you've got this thief here too, who wants to come in and try to get into this relationship. So they're neck and neck. There's two, op there's two potentialities here, the real deal and the fraud. The emperor is here, though, a father figure. And he's like, he's like turning this guy away. He's like, nope, this isn't even a daydream for you. Get it out of your head. You're not bringing adversity here. You're going to leave it behind. You're going to walk away is what you're going to do, mature man. This emperor is here and he's like, you're walking away. You're, you're, in a, you're um, an adversary. So get on down the road. He's not a friend. He's not trustworthy. He wants to sabotage the star, but he's not able to. Oh, 
main mail. God, yeah, they're right up next to each other. The King of Wands and this thief, this mature man and this main male. Somebody's not a friend. They're not trustworthy. And this main male is here to um, see that this star does not get sabotaged. This star is surrounded by the emperor and by the queen of pentacles. And the queen of pentacles is here working on behalf of this reunion with this main male. They're all over this star. The emperor is here too. I mean, it's like, hey, mature man. And this and his his immature woman who's over here, dishonest. They failed. They made mistakes. They're confused. They're confused. They made mistakes. They're confused. They failed to present themselves as the star, as the privileged lady. They're not the privileged lady, and it's obvious. They failed. They didn't get the house. They're in a seven of pentacles reversed. They're distracted. They worked without results. They didn't get the house. They still have hope. I haven't given up on us yet. And it's like, yeah, this thief is still here hounding, like, like stalking this main female who is this star. Look, the main female is this star who is here with um, the main male, the lovers. And you got, and they're high honor and they're high honor. And you got this main male who, and this immature woman who's just, still like right up here with trying to cause adversity but this emperor is like flipping everything upside down adversity isn't working it might be backfiring and this person may need to feel the need to escape whatever it is that they've been doing trying to flip this dream trying to flip this dream Whatever it is they've been doing to bring adversity, it didn't work. So it could be that it backfired. And now they're, this, this mature man is disappointed and walking away, leaving it behind. He may feel the need to escape whatever it was he did. Or escape this emperor. Huh. You got message of concern on the bottom of the deck. False person getting a message of concern about imprisonment for the work they did. So wild, you know. And you know that desperation causes people to do desperate things. And so, I mean, the atmosphere is enlivening and not in a, in a, in a real grand, I mean, in a, in a loving way, you know, because there's a lot of desperation out there. People are freaking out. They didn't, they didn't get what they fought for. They weren't able to sabotage this main male, main female, high honor lovers, stars with spiritual fortunes. That's why, because they're both stars. They both have this phenomenal energy inside and they're coming together and they will have a child. And that's why everybody's freaking out because a child born of these two is going to be like the new human race. And it, and it, and these lovers are being protected. The emperor is is sandwiching in with the with the queen of pentacles, and she's here, ensuring this reunion happens. And this emperor is down here, ensuring that no adversity from this from this um, mature male happens. He's not a friend. He's not trustworthy. Oh my God! I'm just talking, talking, because this is like wow. 
I mean, this is getting down the nitty gritty, and I'm just like, ooh, ooh la la. What's happening, guys? I don't know. This is the collective, oh yes, collective energy, please, spirit, collective energy. What is it that the collective needs to know about this grand shift we're experiencing? Fortune. Yeah, there's a, this person who's in solitude right now in a nightmare in trauma. They were going after the fortune. They were envious of the fortune and the marriage that these two have going on and, and the wealth. There's a new chapter here. They didn't grow. This whole community didn't grow. There's a hermit here shining a light on their history and everything that they have done. And they're, they're exhausted, but they're still trying to defend themselves. They may be making a journey soon. Somebody be, may be making a journey soon. There's a new chapter here. Um, an immature woman was dishonest. And there is a victory over this person. Everything happens in divine order. Letter. Letter in the reverse. So somebody was dishonest. They held up a letter. They held, They hid a letter. They didn't send a letter. They um, hid communications or they sent false communications. They may have tried to pretend to be this main female and sent false letters to um, the person she was going to be married to. Whoever she's in a courtship with, this main male. She may have sent false letters. They were bringing conflict with the hopes of getting this great fortune. They were very abusive, trying to steal this, and it didn't work. They're very worried because they were working with the shadow side, doing things, and now they might have bound themselves. scholar using whatever um, knowledge they had to try to bring this war against this divine couple they're feeling shattered about this they wanted to move on to calmer waters or maybe they're feeling shattered because you are moving on to calmer waters and they got the message about it they're stuck in their pride they wanted to manipulate and misuse their power and callously dominate and control everybody for money For money they're asking forgiveness they um, lost their freedom they're not thankful for anything this king of wands is here very disciplined with no fear and there is a love relationship here but then you've got this thief trying to horn in to hook up with this with this his partner he wants to come in and pretend to be him and there is like a spying going on yeah he's false falseness He's going to come in and mimic this um, King of Wands. He's going to come in and mimic the King of Wands. He's going to pretend to be a friend of the house. He's going to pull some mental magic. He's going to pull mental magic. And he's going to try to um, appear as though he is this King of Wands. Mature man uh, in an eight of cups. He's going to get disappointed and walk away. He's not his adversity backfired or whatever, or it's simply not allowed by this emperor. He may have to go see a doctor. The main male, main female, high honor lovers, stars, they could not sabotage this, this love connection. It's right here in the environment. These people are not friends and they're not to be trusted. They're in despair. 
because you're the gift. Masculine, feminine, main male, main female, you're the star. And these folks weren't able to sabotage you or, or, or get the gift. They weren't able to get the gift. You're the gift and they're in despair because you two came together. Oh my goodness. And the queen of pentacles is here. <clears throat> the working parent working hard to make sure that this reunion happens. She could very well be the mother of this king of wands. And <clears throat> there is this immature woman here. Let me see here. She, so she was writing false letters. She was writing negative letters to whoever this partner is or whatever. Maybe she was trying to create a relationship with this person. Um, they made mistakes. They're confused. Like they feel unclear about where we stand. Where do we stand? They made mistakes and they failed to be seen as uh, as a privileged lady. They're They're seen for what they are. They failed. And they're confused. It's like, what do you mean? Everything they were taught, they did it to a T and it didn't work. Yeah. They're in despair over this gift. These gifts coming together. These two. Oh, look. And we got love on the bottom of the deck. Yes. Love reunion. That's a love reunion. And they're in deep sorrow. Deep sorrow over this. Frivolity in the reverse, house in the reverse, seven of pentacles in the reverse. They worked without results and they're disappointed <clears throat> and they're no longer having any fun. <clears throat> Excuse me. They're no longer having any fun. And you've got this main female, main male reunion, love and hope. So they're still not giving up on it, you know, and it could be. You know, there's this uh, sigh going on, you know, a little bit of melancholy while you wait, you know, but this is over. This is ending. This is, there's a big death here. There's a death here. There's a servant. There's a young woman who's a servant who is an enemy, a pleasure seeker. So there's somebody who's who's being a who's a servant. She's a younger woman. She's an enemy who's seeking pleasures and she's wanting to cause misfortune for this reunion. Just so you know, if you have a servant she wants to cause a misfortune for this reunion for this sweetheart because she's haughty. Because she's an arrogant, she's arrogant and she knows that this wife or your future wife is very consistent, very constant. And they don't want that. They want to be your lover. <laughs> they want to be your lover, king of wands. They want to have your child, but they're your foe. They're fighting against you. They want to tie you up and have something to do with your life, but they just don't want to love you. They just want to mess you up. Mess you up. So, yeah, there's a servant here who's all into that. <clears throat> servant could be a secretary. It could be um, a servant really could be, you know, the one who go get, goes and gets the mail, you know. Um, it could be anybody Anybody who has the ability to send false documentation to a particular um, person, you know, like in the in the um, unseen in the other dimensions and the higher realms where people communicate, you know, I mean, the, your average Joe who's working his life away until he dies doesn't know about this stuff. But it's like there's there's the ability to communicate with uh, people in other you know, it could be telepathically or otherwise. They may have tried to mimic this main female. They may have tried to, but they made mistakes. 
They're in sorrow because they made mistakes. They're not the privileged lady. They're an actor, an actress. And you know, the, this, the, the thing is, is that I think many of us are at the point now where it's like, man, I don't know. The facade is really good. What can I say? There's mercy being shown here. The emperor is here. They were envious of this marriage and the fortune, the spiritual fortune that is that these two combined create. Or the fact that these two combined means that the fortune is going to be allocated to one position. And then, you know, if somebody were able to hook up with him and somebody were able to hook up with her, then they could split the fortune and, you know, do whatever. But if these two come together and they combine that fortune and then they have a child and the child rules that fortune and then the child has children, man, that's like... Two king that's like a that's like a prince and a princess coming together. That's like two the, the merging of two kingdoms. Queendoms, whatever you want to call them. And these ones who were so um, envious, they weren't able to sabotage the union. They're in despair. And the, I mean they're they're in serious despair because they didn't get the gift. And they're not even a friend that can be trusted. These people know it. They're high value. <clears throat> and this is the conclusion they have gained here. And these ones who are in despair, they're facing loneliness, disappointment. Oh, wow. I wasn't supposed to go there, but I guess maybe I was, I guess maybe that's just the way it went, man. I skipped a whole bunch of stuff. I was supposed to go here. Anyway, that's where that wound up. So what we got here in the challenge position then is domination. It could be that um, they're challenged by a dictatorship. Maybe they were fighting a dictatorship. They were fighting what they deemed a dictatorship. These two people coming together, they deem it as a future dictatorship. And they were doing everything they could to take these two out so that it didn't happen. They're dishonest, immature woman, making false reports, sending false letters. They ran out of time. There is a victory here. Everything happens in divine order. I got to remember that when I run out of patience and get all negative in the head, you know, it's like I get I, I get flashbacks of being like 20 years old and wanting everything now, now it's got to happen now, you know, and that sucks because when you're spontaneous and you need things now, it's like usually things require somewhat of a planning, you know, I mean. So it's wild, you know, and I'm really grateful that that energy only hits me in a very minor way now. Oh, their goal was to stop this promise. They're a scholar. They used all their knowledge to stop this promise by bringing conflict. But they didn't get the they didn't get the great fortune. They used all their knowledge. To try their goal was to stop this promise and instead they're worried because they were their knowledge is from the shadow side their knowledge is from the shadow side it was all about money they feel broken and shattered because you're moving on they got the message you're moving on they're stuck in their pride. Their, their expectation was to manipulate, control, and dominate you. Misuse their power in a big way by playing mind games. By really, really messing with the conscious, the field of awareness, the field of consciousness by playing mind games. Illogical mind games. 
misusing their power, their pride. I love myself and I see myself in everyone. Like they wanted to like make all the minds like their mind, like mind control. You get to, you get to transition. You're moving on. You're going to move on to calmer waters and they're bound to their commitments. And they're feeling shattered about this. If you have any markings such as this, please know that there are this, this thief out here who will know who you are because they've been studying you. They've been pulling cards on you. They've been reading on you. They've been trying to find out. They've been saying things like, um, how, well, are you sure you can, are you sure you can identify her? And it's like, yeah, they've got this tattoo. So, so that's what it is. They're going to be identifying people by their body markings and they're going to come in. And so if you meet somebody, it might just be wise to keep these things covered because your real deal person will know you, um, regardless. And these frauds, they don't have that connection. They don't have that. They're false. They're false. They're a false friend. They want to get into your house, but your house is here. Your, your true love is with this king of wands who's disciplined and no fear. You've got this. Yeah. What a freak. This is going to be edgy. And I think that's what happened in the previous cycle. She picked the wrong freaking dude. And that's why you have the feminine getting brutalized because they keep picking the wrong freaking swing. I don't even know why it's necessary, to be quite honest. What is it proven good for? These ones, they, they, the nowadays, the majority of families are broken homes, fatherless, you know, and the mothers often have really serious issues, you know, and they're trying to hold it all together, man. And it's terrible what they've turned this into manipulating the field of consciousness and the relationship status of people by manipulating minds and experiences and the dream state and the, the energies of the body to amplify the thoughts, you know, to magnify them. So, okay. This King of Wands is not blind. He's disciplined. He's not, he doesn't have any fear. He's not blind. And there will be no compromise here. He's aware of this thief. This King of Wands is aware of this thief. So the King of Wands is here. There's the lovers here. The thief is here. There's the courtship here. You've got discipline, no fear, knowing, can see clearly, and there's no compromise. So, and then you've got this thief down here who's a false person and he just wants to get into the house. He wants a house and a friend and he's going to appear. He wants to come off as though he's a friend and he wants to date you. He's trying to figure out how to come in. And so he's going to target you by your, by your body markings. So if you have anything like that, if you're out and about, it might behoove you to wear longer sleeves. If you have them on your legs, to wear longer pants so that um, these ones can't target you in that fashion. Make it as hard on them as you can. And the emperor is here doing just that. This dude's going to have to go see a doctor after the emperor is done with him. It's like, no, you don't get this dream. You're going to have to withdraw. And now you're going to need to escape. And you better hope you can go see the doctor because your adversity isn't welcome here, mature man. The emperor... Oh! Has spoken. The emperor has spoken.
King of Wands is here. Queen of Pentacles. Emperor. This is a triad. Father, Son, Mother. Holy smokes. And they want this star to be with their son. And they got this thief all up in their business. And there, this emperor is not playing. This thief is going down. And they're going to need a doctor. They're going to need a doctor. You're going to need a doctor. Whatever adversity you were intending to bring, it's backfiring. It's backfiring. And so are all your daydreams. So are all your daydreams. You're going to need to go see to the doctor and there's not going to be anything they can do for you. You better just walk away. I mean, I didn't say it. Freaking Amber said it. They're aware. This king of wands is not blind. There will be no compromise. He's not afraid of you. He's very disciplined. He sees that you're a false person and you're here trying to snatch up his love relationship. Trying to be a false friend. Trying to... Ooh. There will be no saving this failure. You cannot cause an accident for this love, re this love reunion. There will not be any accidents for this reunion. Or if you tried to send an accident to this reunion, it failed. If you tried to send any kind of danger to these people, it failed. And there's no saving you because there's 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 sorrow and there's like misfortune. We saw it there. It's like the house is on fire, man. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. You got the seven of wands. Distractions working without results. It's not fun anymore. They didn't get the house. They didn't get the house. The thief did not get the house. Oh, yeah, this main male, he ain't giving up on you, main female. You guys got adventures to go on. You guys are king and queen of that mountain. <laughs> You're going to have a family. You're going to have a baby. You're all calm. Oh, my goodness, this is great. <laughs> should walk away you should walk away you should walk away that emperor is not fooling around with your adversity it's backfiring i don't know if it's he's doing anything other than causing a reversal that's the thing is he is i think he's just causing reversals for whatever adversity this mature man is trying to bring against this couple it's just backfiring the daydreams are crushed walk away walk away walk away walk away walk away walk away See you on the next one, everybody.